In this step-by-step -step tutorial, you will learn how to fill PDF with Squarespace new form submission using PDF.co and Zapier. We will use this sample fillable PDF in this demo. First, let's start by making a zap. Next, type in and select Squarespace from the list of the apps. Next, choose the new form submission as the trigger event. Then, select the form that you would like to use. Now, let's test the trigger to make sure there are no errors in the setup. Before we proceed to another steps, we will show you first how to get the fillable information. Kindly, log into your pdf.co account. Then, click the helper tools menu and choose the get pdf info tools. Next, Enter the URL of your source file. Here's the information that we need to fill out the fillable field name. Now, let's add another app and select the pdf.co for the app event. Next, choose the PDF filler from the list of available action events. We will now set up the PDF filler configurations. For the source file fields, add the URL of your source file. For the fillable fields, Set the value of the following fields. The page index, the name, and the value fields. For the output PDF name fields, it would be better to add the name of the person who submitted the form to make the filled PDF unique to each other. Now, let's send a request to pdf.co to process the PDF filler module. To complete the steps, we will add another app event and select the Google Drive. Next. Choose the upload file from the list of the action events. Let's set up the Google Drive configuration to upload and submit our file. For the drive fields, select your drive to use. In the folder field, enter the folder where you would like to upload the file. For the file field, add the URL from the pdf.co actions. For the convert to document field, Set to false if you want the filled PDF form to become non-editable. Now, let's send the upload file to Google Drive to see the result. Here's the PDF that we successfully uploaded to Google Drive and filled out the fillable field name. For more tutorials, you may visit our YouTube channel or on our website. Thank you for watching.